Hi, everybody. Happy Monday. I'm Joe for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com, coming at you with 2022 Panini Legacy Football. Four box. Uh, pick your team number 17. No vet common ship. And if you follow the instructions here, you got a chance at a little bit of break credit. And we'll do that at the end of this video. Big thank you to everyone here for getting in on it. The final four box of this case that we popped open is loaded up, so if you want to run this back tonight, I am down. Steven Kendrick, Stephen K with double last spot mojo, cleaning out this break, closing out this break. So thanks to him. He's got a shot at break credit. Thanks to everybody for making this happen. All right, we're looking for two autographs per box on average. A lot of fun parallels in here. Mini cards, nice rookie autographs. This is the sort of product that where we start seeing uh, seeing these guys in their pro gear. Most most of them anyway. We start to see them in their pro gear. I guess maybe college uniform, but pro logos. So we're getting closer and closer seeing all the all the rookies in their pro uniforms finally. But this is a nice sort of preseason break, traditionally. It's fall into preseason. Season Evan Phillips, Dodgers reliever, has been having 1 4 ERA over 45 innings. Opponents are only hitting 150 off of him. All right, box one of four. Good luck, everybody. Out of 125, Rondé Barber. Kenny Pickett, and here's our first rookie auto for the Ravens, David Ajabo. That is for Rick and the Ravens. No, Evan Phillips, what's going on? Why are the trainers out there? Kenny Pickett for Peter and the Steelers. The barber goes to Simon. Oh, it went off his leg. A comeback off his leg. That's why the trainers are out there. Tom Brady under the lights insert. Jalen Hurts to 150 for the Fly Eagles Fly. That'll be for Patrick and the Eagles. Our first mini is Khalil Shakir to 75 for the Buffalo Bills. Aaron with the Bills. Got an orange parallel here. That is Austin Eckler, 23 out of 199. 
remember what Austin Eckler did last year? He 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 had like a sort sort of a social media thing. This goes to the Chargers, Logan M, um, where he said that he if if he was in your like daily fantasy lineup or something like that, and he was the reason why you won, like he would send like a jersey to you. I, I wonder how many people actually cash in on that. Travis Kelsey, two ninety nine for the uh, Chiefs. That'll go to Sean Robinson. Got a mini Cooper Cup. And we've got a Pierre Strong Jr. rookie autograph for the Patriots. That's going to be for Karen and her Pats. Lamar Jackson. <laughs> Gilo's still thinking about how I don't have an air fryer? I have, a, I have an oven and a toaster oven. I don't have a microwave either, Gilo. single, but I wouldn't say I'm in a relationship either. If you catch my drift, Gilo. Ooh, and a one of one. Mark Andrews. Gilo's saying if you're single, you don't have an air fryer. I don't know how your life is lived by cooking with pots and pans and Pyrexes and ovens and you know, cook. I cook. Rick Thomas with the Mark Andrews one of one. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. And here is a Jalen Tolbert autograph. I feel like people have been saying good things about him. Logan with the Dallas Cowboys. Malik Willis and eight out of ten Damian Pierce for the Texans. Nice low numbered card for Patrick in Houston. Air fries for the Patrick Mahomes of kitchen utilities? I feel like you're doing a disservice to Patrick Mahomes. I feel like he is a uh, he is a really expensive like espresso machine. A uh, He's like La Crisette kitchenware. There's Brees Hall to 125. 
It's not just an air fryer that you get at Target. There's David Bell, four out of 50. And there is to 199, Kyle Hamilton for the Ravens. So you're saying he's the whole package like an air fryer? I don't know, I think your, your, uh, your scope of kitchenware, G-Lo, seems pretty narrow. You gotta work on expanding those horizons. Give Patrick Mahomes the real credit that he deserves. He's like a Cousinart food processor, the way he chops up defenses. Chilo. Something really nice like that. There's Bailey Zappi. I think I heard a broadcast where the announcers are saying Zappi, so I'm going to go with that for now. That goes to Karen and the Patriots. And we got a Jeremy Rucker rookie autograph for Nico and the Jets. Air fries like the Raiders, right? They are the whole package, Gilo, using your definition. Thanks. Coming from a Chiefs fan, that's a lot of respect. I appreciate that. Aaron Miller with the ATL. All right, halfway through this four box break. Here comes box three, pick your team seven. Um, Picker Team 18 is on the site right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com, and that is the final four boxes of this fresh case that we popped open uh, a few breaks ago. And then I'll have to double check. I don't know. We'll cross that bridge after we finish break 18, but pretty sure I saw one more case of Legacy that we can work on after break 18, unless the Personals channel has been selling those boxes out, so we may not have more to post. Either way, I'm getting close to wrapping up our run of legacy football. I think it was a good run. We pulled a lot of nice hits out of here, so keep at it while supplies last. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Uh, some Clyde Edwards Elaire for the Chiefs to 199. Who has Gilo's Chiefs? That would be Sean Robinson. And our autograph is for the Patriots, Tyquan Thornton. That goes to Karen and the Patriots. I really wish he was, I don't know what number he is on the Patriots, but if he's going to sign like that, I wish he was number 11. Right, because they kind of look like ones. I'll have to write a letter to, to Tyquan Thornton. And now that we're in an era where football players can wear whatever number they want, right? Everybody can wear whatever they want, so. There's Mike Evans, 299 for the Buccaneers, Simon. Uh, 
got Under the Lights to 75, Matt Corral. Who I believe is a Carolina Panther, Stephen Kendrick. Another Desmond Ritter right here. Our shipping team will look all that stuff up. Um, yeah, he is a Panther. Still kind of in preseason mode on kind of remembering where all these uh, players go. There's Jameson Williams, 4 out of 25. Nice low number for the Lions. I feel like all the training camp reports seem to suggest that the Lions are pretty high on this guy, Aaron, with the Lions. There's Sean Alexander for the Seahawks, Stephen K. Orange parallel to 125. He's pretty good in his day. Another Kenny Pickett rookie card. I'd love to see like a low numbered card of his or something like that. Peter with the Steelers, maybe some ink. And we got a Dak Prescott, two out of 25 for Dallas. That'll be for Logan. Got a mini Jonathan Taylor. And we got a Roger uh, Worley. 100 out of 100. Hollow Fame autograph. That nice hollow parallel. What's the, what's the story with this guy? This goes to the Arizona Football Cardinals. One of NFL's first shutdown cornerbacks. Worley, I think, let opposing uh, let opposing QBs know the right side of the field closed for business. Those who tested him quickly learned, as Roger Staubach did in 1975, the Dallas Signal Caller was intercepted three times on December 7th. Cardinals won 31-17. I'm going to go with the Arizona Cardinals. That'll be for Simon. All right, fourth and final box. Good luck, everybody. going on in the NFL here. Uh, Seahawks trade for wide receiver slash tight end. JJ Arthiga Whiteside. I didn't realize he was designated as a wide receiver slash tight end. Traded uh, Arthiga Whiteside for defensive bags, Ugo Amadi. Seahawks are planning to cut Amadi as part of their first wave of roster reductions, but found a trade partner. Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't realize that the Eagles moved the 6'2", 237-pound Arthiga Whiteside to tight end earlier this offseason, and the Seahawks plan to use him as a hybrid receiver tight end, according to a source. Arthigo Whiteside was viewed as a long shot to make the uh, Eagles final roster. Yeah, it was a weird description on that old schooler, right? I guess I guess maybe the 
It's his one of the first NF, one of the NFL's first shutdown corners. I don't know. Maybe the maybe that secondary back in the day was, you know, was more team oriented as opposed to the individual play defensive playmaker. I don't know. My football knowledge of that of that time period is not very strong. We got an orange mini to 125. That's Garrett Wilson for the Jets. This little little guy going to Nico. Daxton Hill, rookie autograph for the Bengals. Eddie. Right, yeah, that's the wide receiver tight end. How many of those are out there? It's kind of like <laughs> Gilo saying wide receiver tight end is like a schmedium sized shirt. There's Kenny Pickett, Peter with the Steelers. Sorry, knocking over cards here. We got a Chase Claypool 24 out of 50 for the Steelers. See what I knocked over here. Nothing too crazy there. What else? Let's go back over here. And there is Jersey and Auto, Matt Corral for Carolina. That's last spot mojo, Stephen K. 70% of the time, last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. That's 24 out of 99. Someone was saying, I wasn't watching that Panthers, I haven't watched a lot of Panthers preseason action, but someone, I feel like someone in the chat was saying, hey, Matt Corral actually looked, or Coral Corral, actually looked pretty good. In preseason action for whatever that's worth. Marquise Brown to 150, that's still Ravens edition. That'll be for Rick. And another Desmond Ritter rookie card for, uh, for Aaron. There is Deontay Johnson, 23 out of 75, little mini for Peter and the Pittsburgh Steelers. All these Kenny Pickett rookie cards and other quarterbacks, we really, really haven't seen an auto for, for these guys. All right, we got Brett Favre, Legends to 199. Aaron with the Packers. Is this a parallel? All right, at least we got something numbered here. 002 out of 100, Peter with Pittsburgh. Gets the Pitt Panther picket. And we got Carson Palmer for the Bengals to 299. And a Marcus Allen for the ages insert for the Raiders. And there you have it. Another four boxes of Legacy Football in the books. That was Pick a Team 17. I'll see you next time for the next break. I'm Joe. Bye-bye.